I know Chiggs is in here recording this. No Chiggs moved in here, right? So whatever you oh, say. Sorry, you know Chiggs gonna have, have everything up there. Whatever you say, Chiggs gonna be on YouTube with it, man. Man, are we here to pod or are we here to protect our friendships and relationships? This is called podcast politics. So today on Improper Improv, Joe Budden called out Queen's Flip for refusing to talk and contribute to the conversation during the Rick Ross and DJ Envy segments that they had. Most of you guys have seen DJ Envy and Rick Ross go back and forth regarding their car shows, but as of late, it has gotten personal to now Rick Ross talking about DJ Envy's wife and kids. And most of you guys know Envy can be very sensitive, especially about his family. He does not play about his wife or anybody talking about his wife. Personally, I thought this whole thing was just a rollout for their car shows coming up. Envy and Ross, they've known each other for a while. They both know that each other does car shows every single year. So to me, it just looked like fake beef. But Queen Slip, who's pretty cool with DJ Envy, he has known Envy for a very long time. And he does make that clear. On today's podcast that dropped, when the conversation came up, Everybody in the room took turns stating their opinion on the beef between Envy and Ross. Besides Queen's Flip, who's quiet. Joe ends up calling him out on the podcast. Queen's Flip responded saying, How can I laugh at this beef without feeling some kind of way that this guy Ross is talking about my man and his family? Is he written his crib out? Is any of that valid here? He said it's 50 written his crib out. Is any of that valid? Flip, this is your man. Speak up. You have a mic in front of you. Wake the fuck up in here. Nigga, you know I'm not saying that. I spoke to you and I'm not saying nothing. I want to comment on it. <laughs> you asking me for, nigga. Stop trying to pull me out. I told you this before. I'm not commenting on these niggas. You didn't say none of that. How it started, you didn't, nigga. But I, it's fine. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. It's fine. Well, today, Joe continued to press him on that issue. And here's what he said. Ross is more vocal and funnier in the insults pertaining to Envy's family. Listen, what? So I got to shut whoa, up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we draw clear lines and we communicate them so people know who we are. True. We not with people talking about people's family. We are not. No, no, we not. We are not. Your it was kids, funny before the family shit. Women, yeah, I'm not. What do you say? Somebody said somebody with somebody that. family. I don't know. Hold on, shampoo. Yes, yes. So Joe, Joe didn't like. Joe's checking me. He said I tucked my dick in yesterday. He come in here talking about I'm. Pl I don't get paid to do that, and I, you know, all this other. It's not extra. How he felt creating a broadcast but here's my thing this nigga don't tell you when it comes to his friends we gotta stop and edit shit 15,000 times <laughs> this nigga don't tell you how he gotta talk and, and <laughs> grab his head and do shit and, and, and try to check me on the camera like if these are my friends so if you're not gonna respect my broadcast in front of the show get the f he says all this bullshit but when it comes to my friends I gotta sit there and talk and engage get the fuck out of here nigga can I respond I'm not engaging you can't force me to engage you can I, can't can I respond and then you want to bring niggas' jobs up uh, and contract. Yeah, go, yeah, yeah. When, yeah. when can I respond? Right now. Let's count friends. <laughs> let's count them. Now you're nervous. No, let's count them. Now your whole body's shaking. Let's count them. Now your heart trembling. Envy. Now your heart. Right, yeah. Now your heart beating fast. Right, I told phone. you, you put the E in motion. You said, yeah. <laughs> you said that yesterday. That was nice. Wow, you're a rapper. You can say nice line. I thought it was fire. I used it against somebody today. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. Don't take my shit. You got a lot of friends. That's all. You got a lot of friends. But you, my man, I would never sit down you and let nobody talk. Of, I would never. You have a lot. These of people I have relationships people with. People specifically been, call you too. Come on, man. Yo, uh, what we topic. doing, man? Joe feelings. Joe what feelings. What happened? With, but, what feelings? What, what you was sticking up for envy? Cause that's your friend, though. Since when a topic with his yo, friends you, come on. up, uh, yo, shampoo. No, I'm just asking because I know that's your man. I'm just Stop. saying. Yes, I was. Same thing when you try to talk to me about Star so and I so stuck up for Star. So it's not COE. Yeah, yeah, hold on. Same thing when you try to mention Star to me and I stuck up for him. I'm yeah. consistent oh, in sticking snitching. up for my niggas. Now you snitching. Yeah, I am. Now you snitching. Yeah. Don't ask me the question. Now I'm consistent snitching. for sticking up for my niggas. What you got to say? Yeah, but when I, when, I, when I tell you something, when I tell you something, <laughs> it's not necessary and confidential, but I'm not thinking <laughs> that you just going to keep stuff between me. I don't say, yo, don't say nothing. No, I'm not. I'm not. not. Nigga, like, number one hip-hop podcast. podcast. With the number Ooh. one hip hop topic fighting all weekend and did the. Yeah, you can't let your friendship get in between what you That's do what on did. the mic. That's what he I did. I can. Because yeah, I if they get mad. I can. And I, I don't. know, I know, I know you saying like that, but I'm saying, but if you do and they get mad, then you're supposed to say, yo. 
I'm, you just, sh- I'm just kidding hey, the facts. And that part, he, you shouldn't even want friendships that's that fragile where you can't <laughs> Dang, laugh at some saying. shit. That's what I'm the saying. The fuck out of here with these hip hop. Yeah, Hip hop phony You're perception relations. I don't want to hear none of that You're shit. You're the same way. I don't want to hear none of that. You're the same hip way. Hip hop perception for the look friendships. You niggas got for the look friendships. Ain't nobody buying Christmas gifts, birthday gifts, vacationing together. Y'all ain't doing Thanksgiving together. Y'all don't say y'all don't say happy birthday to niggas. The fuck are we talking about? We friends. Fuck out of here. I, we, we both, I don't want to hear none of that for the look friendship we, shit. What, I ain't friends with none of you so niggas. So I'm friends with Envy. Leave it where it's at. I'm not friends with Envy for, for the look. So did you feel? Do you feel that way? For the look? Well, I don't know. So why you said that? <laughs> DJ Envy is my man. I got money with him. He got you. me money. I knew I, since I was a kid. Yeah, What's but the that truth? shouldn't. That, but then, that's how I feel. But that that's the case. You should be able to say anything you want to say. And I chose yep, not yep, to yep. say nothing. Yep, he right. My he wife, right. My wife said, oh, you, I swear to my mother this morning, she said, oh, you better stop talking about people, uh, 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 you know, because rock, you know, all that shit. Mm-hmm. Right? And she said, oh, you, you, that's all you. Now, I'm not mad at Flip for trying to defend his friend, but obviously there's a way you can speak on these issues. If and if somebody you love is involved, in it everybody on the podcast has somebody that they refuse to talk about negatively for joe is diddy if i'm flip i'm bringing up all the diddy topics and watch how quiet joe gets it's part of podcasting you're gonna have to speak on these issues especially if you have friends that's in the industry eventually somebody that you're close to is gonna do something that's gonna put them in a negative light and you're gonna have to speak on it tell me what you guys think about this man what do you guys think about joe press and flip about this the next day Post your comments below, subscribe to my channel, like this video. I'll see you guys later, man.